Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, and today I have for you, for your entertainment value, I have the 2019 Stratomatic uh, Chicago Cubs against the 2019 Stratomatic Chicago White Sox. Um, I figured since I had bought the game and we had the new game and my draft is still another almost week away or at the end of the week that, uh, you know, I'd fill the time by doing a Chicago versus Chicago game. So <clears throat> the game will be in uh, the south side of Chicago. So we're going to be home. And uh, I am going to say that they will put up um, Kyle Hendricks, and we will send up, uh, I am going to say, who do we want to put up? We'll send up Ivan Nova even though he is not on the team anymore. So Nova versus Hendricks, an April game, I'm just making that up, between the uh, Chicago teams. So let's get going. And there's our stadium. And there's Nova. Facing Kyle Schwarber. Now, remember, I didn't make these lineups. So, if you're a Cubs fan watching this and the Cubs end up losing, <clears throat> I want to hear the complaints because I didn't I didn't alter the White Sox lineup and I didn't alter the Cubs lineup. So, he's out. And that brings up Castellanos, Castellanos, however you just pronounce his name. And that's going to be a hit. So he's on first with Bryant up, Chris Bryant, who flies out to center. And there are two down with Castellanos at first, in the top of the first for the Cubs. And Anthony Rizzo up. And he is, looks like he's going to fly to center as well. Where Engel will handle it. And the Cubs get nothing in the first. And now up comes the White Sox. The hometown White Sox with Lori Garcia. And what's that? That looks like a hit. So Garcia gets a single. And now Moncada is up. Come on, Moncada. What do we got? You got a strikeout? Probably. Now Abreu is up. And he is going to rip a double. Over the head of Hayward in center. Uh, I think I'm going to hold the runners. So it's going to be runners at second and third with one out. And James McCann up. And he is going to line out. And now with two down, we have Jimenez up. And I don't know what that is. Uh, yeah. That's a base hit. So um, Jimenez is on at first. <clears throat> and he drove in both runs. We have a 2 nothing lead, and that's going to be a single for Timmy Anderson. I'm going to hold the runners, and so now we have runners at first and second. With two down for Yolmer Sanchez, who is no longer on the team and strikes out. But we come away in the first inning with a 2 nothing lead, which hopefully um, can continue to be held by Ivan Nova. Contreras up with an out already in the uh, second, and that's going to be a line out. So that's two outs for the Cubs. <clears throat> and now Hayward is up with two down. 
and he is going to ground out the second. So the Cubs losing two nothing, and we go to the top of the, uh, or we go to the bottom of the second with Ryan Cordell up, and he is going to ground out first, and that's going to be Rizzo. And what happens? And that's an out. But you got to figure that that was what was going to happen because Rizzo is a first base one, and now. Adam Engel, my main man, Adam Engel, is going to strike out. And then Lurie Garcia. And he is going to line out. And so we're out of the inning. And after two, the score is White Sox two and Cubs nothing. Or as uh, Hawk Harrelson would say, good guys too. And the Cubs nothing. And now Bote comes up and he gets a home run one to eight. Are you kidding me? Bote takes Ivan Nova deep. That is crazy. That's crazy bad. All right. So Albert Elmora Jr. had a bad year last year and he's going to ground out short. But the Cubs have cut the lead to, to a one run. And now Schwarber's up with an out, and he strikes out. And that brings up Castellanos, and Castellanos is going to ground out to third, but the Cubs did cut the deficit to one on a home run by Bote. And now we have Moncada coming up, and he's going to swing away. And that's going to be a home run. Home run Moncada. So we get the run right back on a solo home run by Johan Moncada. And now Jose Abreu is up, and he's going to strike out. And now James McCann steps in, and James McCann is going to have a single. That brings up Eloy Jimenez, and he strikes out. So now we have Timmy Anderson coming in. And that's going to be a fly out. But we did extend our lead back to two runs with a solo shot by Moncada. And now Nova pitching Brian to lead off the top of the third. And he's going to earn the fourth, and he's going to rip it up. So, Bryant on second, Rizzo up. And that is going to be, what is that? That's going to be an out. But it does move Bryant over to third. Now, Bryant is 90 feet away with Baez up and one out. And I got a single there, so knocks in a run. And Contreras steps up. With a man at first and one out, and he's going to strike out. And now Hayward is up, and Hayward is going to fly out. Could have had a double, but no. So the Cubs strike again and get back within one run. And so now the score is three to two, going to the bottom of the fourth with. Yolmer up, and he's going to strike out. And now that brings up Ryan Cordell, and Ryan Cordell's going to fly out. And then that brings up Adam Engel, my main man. Adam Engel strikes out. So we go to the top of the fifth now. White Sox leading 3-2. Nova dealing to Bote, who homered the last time up and might. No. That was a ground ball. So Albert Almara Jr. comes up, and he is there. Cubs are down by a run, and he looks like he's going to fly out. 
possibly. And yes, he does fly out. And now Schwarber's up with two down. And his team down by a run. And he is going to line out. So we go to the bottom of the fifth with a three to two lead. Lurie Garcia up. And he is going to fly out. Cut a homer there. The splits were there for him, but he couldn't grab it, and it's going to be an out. And Moncada comes up, and he's going to swing away. And last time I did that, it was a home run, but this time it's a strikeout. <clears throat> and that brings up Jose Abreu. And what do we got? Probably a ground out. Or maybe a ground out? No. It's going to be a hit. So Abreu at first, McCann up with two down. And that's going to be a ground out. So Nova's dealing here in the top of the sixth. We are winning three to two. And that is going to be an out. Ground ball out to Moncada. Moncada over to Abreu. Now Chris Bryant's up. And that's going to be a strikeout. And now that brings up Anthony Rizzo, who is out. So we're going to the bottom of the sixth, ladies and gentlemen. And the White Sox up three to two. Jimenez up at the plate, swing away. And he's going to ground out. And now Tim Anderson comes up the uh, batting champion from last year and he's going to fly out and then that brings up yolmer sanchez and he's going to fly out and now we're headed to the top of the seventh and i am not going to keep entrusting this to uh nova so i'm going to go to the bullpen and i'm going to bring in Evan Marshall. And he will pitch to Javi Baez. And that's going to be a home run. So thank you, Evan Marshall, for allowing the game to get tied. And that brings up Wilson Contreras. Now the Cubs are in a tie game. It's a whole new ball game, folks, but there's a strikeout. And Jason Hayward comes up. Jason Hayward is going to ground it short. And let's see if he makes the play. And he does. And that brings up Bote, who has a home run for the Cubs today. And that'll be a fly out, I'm thinking. And that is a fly out. But the Cubs have tied the game. And now at the seventh inning stretch, we are in a tie game. And Hendricks is still out there. And we got Ryan Cordell at the plate. And he's going to pop out to short. And that brings up Adam Engel. And he's going to be hit by the pitch. And that brings up Lurie Garcia with one on and one down. And uh, that's going to be a strikeout. And then Moncada comes up. Two down now with Engel at first. Moncada up. And that's going to be a strikeout. So, leaving Evan Marshall out there now. And he gets a ground out to second. <clears throat> and Schwarber's up. Schwarby strikes out. And now Castellanos. 
Man, he looks like he's going to ground out short. So we go to the bottom of the eighth. If we can get a run here, we just got to hold him again in the top of the ninth, and then White Sox win. And Hendricks is still out there, and Jose Abreu steps in against him, and he's going to fly out. That brings up James McCann. And is that going to be a home run? Don't even tell me that James McCann just went deep. And he did. So you are telling me. Because he did. So we get a uh, one-run lead on uh, the uh, McCann Jack. And now Jimenez is up. Eloy Jimenez. And now he brings in C-Check, who is actually on the White Sox. So we got our own man being used against us. Um, I'm going to say swing away. And that's going to be, did he make an error? No, he didn't. So Tim Anderson's up with two down. And that's a strikeout. So... Let's take a look at this. Um, we're going to the top of the ninth with a one-run lead. I am going to take Evan Marshall out of the game. It's just a matter of who's going to come in. And, uh, well, it's not going to be Herrera, I can tell you that. Uh, Jace Fry, no, not Jace Fry. Colome, yes, we are going to bring in Colome. And do we have any kind of defense on this bench? Does not look like we do. No, we really don't. So that's going to be what's going on. It's all up to, to uh, Colome, starting with the first batter he'll face, Chris Bryant. <clears throat> and he hits him. Nice. So now that brings up Anthony Rizzo. And he's going to line out Max. Thank you. Two down. Two down and Javi Baez. Up. And he strikes out and the White Sox will win this game due to the expert managing of yours truly, Sportsman Z. And uh, I just want to remind everybody, subscribe to the channel. If you like this, I can do more games. I can even do game by request. But yes, the uh, let's see, let's get the box score and see what happened here. And we know what happened. Nova went six, pretty good innings, allowed two runs, four hits, and Evan Marshall went two and allowed a run, and then Colome came in and closed the door. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. But for right now, it's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.